Okay, I have just audio modulated this 555 timer. Of course, I have my little speaker I've been playing with. Here we have a little radio. It's nice and cheap, so if something were to catastrophically fail on the 555 area, no biggie. So I just have an old headset cable. And uh, there's one of the old leads. It's one of them. I'm only using uh, two because from so far from what I know, you can only use one channel. But uh, see, there's one headset. Red's going into pin 5 of the 555 timer. And uh, negative, which is the same wire that goes to the capacitor. So I'll have the negative going to that side of the capacitor, which does go to negative if you follow the wire. Um, it's very simple. You can do when you have a flyback hooked. When you have a flyback transformer hooked up and a MOSFET and all that stuff for a flyback driver from the 555, all you have to do is uh, stick the negative output of the audio, which I, from what I found out just now, it doesn't even matter how you hook up the poles, but one of them's louder than the other. I have this hooked up, so it's the wildest. The wiring, which is the wildest. Anyway, um... You stick one of the leads from the output of your audio to the negative, which in this case goes to the battery, and the so-called positive output of here goes to pin 5 of the 555 timer. And of course, the higher the frequency you have, the better the quality. So anyway, now that I'm up to a minute 56 for a video length. Okay, first, let's turn it off. You cannot hear that. Why? Because it's at a very high frequency. Let's turn it down. Okay, now this sounds very low quality, but let's give it a try. Okay, let's crank up the frequency. Yeah. Radio transmissions. Anyway, let's crank up the frequency. It's as simple as that. Okay, let's change it to a better song. Sorry, I don't like Eminem. That song was good until it got overplayed. Country, yeah. Boring. Screamo. No, just hard rock. It's not too bad. Whatever the song is, it's coming in pretty well. Okay, I don't like it, but it's coming in with good clarity. So, I'll use this as an example. Just for one more time. Come on, stupid wire. Gay, 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 gay. Yeah. It's pretty clear now. Okay. Now if I was doing this with a flyback, I'd probably want to 
hook up the audio itself to a MOSFET to amplify the signal because I have this cranked up almost all the way right now. If I crank it up anymore, it distorts from this, not from that. But listen how queer that is. That would sound pretty well in an arc. See, I can't even hear it. High frequency. There we go. I would probably be safe hooking that into my laptop, but it's not worth the risk.